anti-abortion activists are turning their attention to Louisiana, which could be the next state to impose tighter restrictions on abortion rights. The pending state house vote comes as legislators in Missouri overwhelmingly passed a sweeping law Friday, placing new restrictions on doctors who perform abortions. The law bans the procedure after eight weeks of pregnancy with no exceptions for rape or incest. Doctors could face up to 15 years in prison for performing an abortion. Kenneth Craig is here with the latest. Kenneth, good morning. Good morning to you, Dana. The Missouri law is the latest victory for the anti-abortion movement, and it comes in the same week that Alabama passed its own law restricting abortions. By your vote of 109 yes and 40 no, you approve the previous, move the previous question. The vote on House Bill 126 restricting abortions in the state of Missouri wasn't close, but it came after a fiery debate on the House floor. I'm here to tell you that our freedom cannot be bought with the blood of our children. We are seizing her and we may as well be the ones tying her hands to the bedposts and forcing her into childbirth. HB 126 bans abortions after a fetal heartbeat can be detected around eight weeks. I will sign the bill as it presented to me. The bill Republican Governor Mike Parson intends to sign does not include an exception for pregnancies that result from rape or incest. This gives more rights to the rapist than it does to the mother. I've, I've never really studied it, but I've heard of the morning after pill, where if someone feels that they've been sexually assaulted, they could go do that. The vote comes just one day after Alabama's Governor Kay Ivey signed into law a similar bill that makes it a felony for a doctor to perform nearly all abortions, with the exception of when a mother's health is at serious risk. The legality of both the Alabama and Missouri laws could ultimately be determined by the U.S. Supreme Court, which ruled in 1973's Roe v. Wade that women have a constitutional right to end a pregnancy. I don't know that we're going to change anybody's opinion right now on anything on that particular issue. On Thursday, Dr. David Eisenberg, medical director of the only Planned Parenthood left in the state of Missouri, told CBS News the law does not settle the issue. It doesn't make abortion go away. It just makes abortion more difficult to access and potentially more dangerous. Missouri is the fifth state to pass a so-called heartbeat bill just this year. Conservative states appear to be emboldened by the Supreme Court's 5-4 conservative majority ever since Justice Brett Kavanaugh joined the court at the end of last year, Anthony. Thanks a lot, Kenneth.